Well, of course, I'm very excited um, to be competing next week in Aachen. Uh, now, especially as a contender for the Rolex Grand Slam, it uh, makes it even nicer. And uh, yeah, I didn't need that, but it gives maybe an extra push for, for the Sunday Grand Prix. Uh, of course, there is pressure when you get in, in the Grand Prix, when you walk in the ring in Aachen, um, when the, you know, the Rolex Grand Prix uh, starts. It's always uh, you know, one of these times where uh, you can you know, feel the butterfly in your stomach. Uh, you, you're nervous anyway, so it's not gonna change this year. Um, I'm excited. This is why I do sport for these kind of moments and um, try to, you know, to 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 change uh, this pressure into uh, motivation and try to enjoy the moment. And uh, this is what I'm gonna do on Sunday. Uh, Venar is a very special horse. Uh, it means a lot to me because uh, we had to go through a lot of downs to, to finally find our way together. And uh, now since three years he's really fighting with me and he's been unbelievable. Uh, he's not a horse that's really famous. Uh, you'd ask a lot of fans or even riders, they probably couldn't even write his name uh, correctly uh, because he's one of these horses that's a little bit common when you look at him, uh, his way of jumping as well. But if you look at his record, what he's won, and especially uh, after this big win in the in the Rolex Grand Prix, in the CP International here in Calgary. Uh, he will be remembered for sure and that's also why I'm so proud today. And um, for the horse, he's really deserved it. He's given me so much and uh, I'm glad that I can give him something back now.